What's up YouTube, this is Prince at ATP 101 and in this video I'm going to show you guys how to jailbreak your Apple TV 2 using Snowbreeze and this Apple TV 2 is running on 5.0.2 or 5.1.1 iOS firmware so you, all you're going to need is definitely the Apple TV 2 and a micro USB micro USB and your Apple TV remote so all the links for Snowbreeze and the version of your firmware will be down in the description. So you want to open up Snowbreeze, drag it to your after you unzip it, you could drag it to your desk file, desktop or just open it up from the from the zip folder right here. So open up Snowbreeze. Then you're gonna get that right there. I'm just gonna plug in my micro USB. Clip it. There we go. I'm gonna plug this up to my computer. that up to my computer and hit OK and then hit the arrow right here shows you all the firmware that it's compatible with and it goes browse for an IPSW remember it's on your desktop so you just wanna let's close out iTunes for now where is it? here it is Apple TV 2 5.0.2 it open see there you go verified they hit continue let me scroll up a little bit and this is an untethered jailbreak for your um device I'm just gonna hit simple mode let's hit next and it's gonna be building the firmware it's gonna extract the IPSW and then build a specific jailbroken firmware for this and then we're gonna restore it to that firmware using iTunes so I'll be back after this part is done okay guys after that's done you will get this message right here saying after setting up your Apple TV the screen may be blank for 60 seconds that's okay you wanna hit OK then you wanna hit OK again and then it will tell you to plug in your micro USB so I'm just gonna get mine right here and plug it in like that it's plugged in and if you can't put it in DFU mode with the micro USB only just plug the um the um the power cord in and the light will come on like that I mean I see it's blinking and then you plug it back out when the blinking starts okay Exit out that. Exit off iTunes. iTunes will pop up when you plug it in. You just want to exit out. Okay. Then you plug it in right now. So you want to hit start and get your Apple TV remote ready. Hit start. And it said prepare to press menu and play pause button. So here we go. For seven seconds. One, two, three. Four, five, six, seven. I said release both buttons and let's see if it goes in DFU mode. So there you go, it's in DFU mode. It says running IREB. And then it said your device is now in Pwn DFU state. Black screen, you may launch iTunes. So I'm gonna hit OK. Minimize that. And iTunes is open. And you wanna hit Shift Restore. When you hit Shift Restore, guys, it will prompt you to get this this right here see you know you got a um a snow breeze um IPSW so we're gonna hit shift restore so we're gonna hit shift on your keyboard hit shift restore and it should give us the chance to choose our um our firmware but it looks like iTunes is kinda of frozen right here for some reason hit shift Restore and there you go. It gives us the chance to choose our um, firmware. And here it is, right here. We're gonna look for Snowbreeze Apple TV to go to desktop. 
and here it is snow breeze apple tv 2 5.0.2 hit ok and hit restore and now it's going to restore to that firmware I'm going to let it run for a little bit I might, I'm not going to show you the whole thing I could take like five or six minutes but as you can see it's restoring and that was quick it said an iPod no that's a different thing I'll let it let it run it's verifying the restore let it run through so now it's restoring I'll come back after the restore is done because I don't want to waste a lot of time waste a lot of you guys time so I'll come back after the restore is done okay guys the restore is almost over and after this whole restore is done I will hook this up to my TV and show you guys that it's actually jailbroken. The restore will be done in a couple of seconds. And I'll show you guys that I'm actually there it is. Your Apple TV has been restored to factory setting. Please disconnect and hook it up to your TV, blah blah blah. So it's okay. Okay guys, so now the Apple TV is hooked up to my TV. And as you can see, if you want to know that it's jailbroken, see right there. I have it on Nido TV. Nido TV is like the jailbroken, it's like Cydia for jailbroken phones. Right now it's on Nido TV and I could tap in there and go to software, install software. And I could install any one of these software right here. XBMC, all those. Whatever I want, I could install. I mean a whole bunch of stuff and I could install whatever and I'm gonna go to settings over here show you guys I'm on actually 5.1 .1. so I go to about and you see it said 5.0.2 but if you hit the button it shows you that the iOS build is actually 5.1.1 this is a little bit a little closer she said 5.1.1 but it's actually 5.0.2 so that's all your jailbreak an Apple TV guys running on 5.1.1 or 5.0.2 and get Nido TV so you can go in there and install whatever and it's prints with ATP 101 rate comment and definitely subscribe for more videos like this and peace. Thanks for watching.